Yeah, yeah, it was, it was, it's a dream come true, you know. It was like after I did the purge, my whole thing was like I really want to play a superhero, and I was hoping that that would launch me into the the rooms essentially to be noticed for that kind of role, and 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 it was. And you know, when Greg and Jeremy reached out and and they considered me for the part, I was like, yes, please, you know, this is. It's been a dream for me, you know, shooting this project has been amazing and the show is, is so different to anything that's been seen before. People are going to love it and I can't wait for everyone to see it. How does he differ in the show to how he was in the, in the movies? Because uh, obviously we only saw a short bit of him in the Justice League, whereas in, you get to play him for, I guess, eight, nine, ten episodes or something. Yeah, well, you know, we get the opportunity to really go back and see Vic Stone's uh, backstory. And also it's at a time in which is not in the same era as, you know, the Ray Fisher version in Justice League. It's a much younger cyborg. It's, you know... The start of his journey as Cyborg, he, he's not got all of his elements yet. We're going to see him grow throughout the series and new gadgets and new experiences and opportunity to grow as, you know, a superhero, a character and also how, you know, he deals with everything which is happening with him being half robot and being a cyborg and we really get to spend a lot of time with the character in the series which I'm, I'm really grateful for. The great thing as well with some of the DC properties that a lot of Arrow and Supergirl and all those guys are getting a lot of support from the channel and they're getting a lot of series and everything like that. I mean, it must be great to be with a show that might continue for, for many many series you might get to just kind of grow with the series as well. Yeah exactly like that's that's the biggest thing and even it's really exciting that you know the prospect of Titans too and being able to you know take this character and, and play in this new DC universe world I have no idea you know what crossovers they're going to do and where or whatever it is, but just the premise of that being able to happen is, is phenomenal and I can't wait. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys! Hey You Guys, huh? Hey you guys, is yeah. that from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey!